else have I got? Ah, I've got this uh, Ray-Ban box. So I actually take this with me. Um, so I put my sunglasses in here. Because what I found was that if I was putting them loose into the bag, potential to lose them, uh, potential to get them broken if it gets squashed. So I put it in this box and, uh, and everything is nice and safe. So there's the front of the box and, uh, and there's the inside. Very nice indeed. There we go. So that's that. Um, I also have ah, so this when I saw this quite some time ago, well over well over two years ago now, the person who was selling it was selling it for something like I'm sure it was something like two hundred dollars, hundred and fifty, two hundred dollars, something like that. And quite clearly, I'm not going to pay pay that kind of money for what this is. So then I saw it on another site for $15. And um, I sent the guy an email saying, are you sure that's $15? Because I wanted to make sure. And he goes, yeah, it's $15. Something like $15, $15 to send to the UK. Bought it, $30 straight away, no mucking about. And here I have a 1992 Ray-Ban sunglasses scarf, silk scarf. This commemorates um, the 1948 St. Mortis games in Switzerland, I do believe. That was selling for something, I think it was $150. $150, and I think it went, I think someone bought it, but I got mine for 30. Mint condition, nothing wrong with it. Um, silk scarf, fantastic. That's one of my better pieces you know that isn't sunglasses fantastic little scarf that very nice indeed and going on from scarves I have this which is a Ray-Ban Beach Club beach towel in white there we go that's that very nice piece I have another towel which is this one here if I roll it up actually so that's the top there And then we have the Zodiac Sun there. And then we have the rest of the towel there. Very nice indeed. I haven't seen this towel anywhere else. Uh, the other one I've seen about, I think there's a few selling at the moment on eBay. Uh, but this particular one I haven't actually seen before. So... Um, that's uh, quite a nice little find. Um, so that's the towels. And then last but not least, um, my other little collection are Ray-Ban Bush and Lum Ray-Ban pins. So um, this is a certificate of authenticity that I've got. Um, this is for the 1996 Olympic Games. These are the pins that, um, that Ray-Ban brought out for the 1996 Olympic Games. This is the complete set 
Um, generally these are sold separately. I don't know why they do that. But me, I managed to get myself the full set. Very happy indeed. Didn't pay much money for it neither. Um, I think I paid less than $50. My, yeah, I think it was less than $50 delivered. So very happy with that. I'm not going to show you all my pins because I've got too many, um, but I do have some very rare ones. But that's my bag of pins there. I've probably got about 40, so I haven't counted it, but I think I've got about 40 pins, something like that. All different. Um, I have um, the complete set. of um, the Lily Hammer pin. Let me get it out for you. Because you always see, you know, um, the, the Lily Hammer pins separate, never together. There's always one of them missing. So, um, I'm sure you've seen them all before. So that's the Lily Hammer pin. So I have all of those. Um, I have got, just randomly, I've got this one. This particular one didn't officially get released. Um, so... So that's it folks, that's all my other stuff that I collect that's not sunglasses. Um, and uh, yeah, oh Christ. So I just dropped my lens. Uh, so yeah, thank you for watching. Please share, please like, please comment, please subscribe. Um, very much appreciate it and I'll see you again next time. Peace.